What is up, YouTubers? Johnza here, and welcome back to my lovely world. In the last video, we have finished up this shooting range, and we have made the rare animal section in the hotel finished. And as you can see, um, I was kind of working on the sixth uh, floor main place a little bit, not like. Just, like, not, like, partially made a whole lot of things, but, uh, yeah. And, man, that's, a like, third diamond in a row. How many diamonds do I even have? 23. Yeah, three in a row. Weird. Can I finally get my 10th gold, please? <laughs> Alrighty, so, uh, yeah, we'll be grabbing a dog. And I was, like, really rushing to get back here. I don't know, like, since I was in the middle rooms, I can't exactly tell when I'm, like, you know... When it's like almost morning or something. Um, I don't know. Is Kate, Cassie? Yeah, I think I've had you recently. I've had you two recently. I know that. I just had you. Rex. Yeah, you know what, Rex? You can come with me for the day. Why not? I don't know. I'm just trying to pick dogs that I haven't had for a while. So. Yeah, okay. Broom. Big dog port. Ported? Where is he? Doggy going home. Eh. Where is he? I can't. Rex! You saw it, Sai. Oh, bro. What the heck? Why were you on the outside? Get back in here. Get inside. God darn it, you're wasting my time. Now sit and stay. Alright, so I'll go up to the, uh... I want to say, yeah, the fifth floor. No, it's floor four. Okay, there we go. So, uh, pretty much in the last video, we have, uh, finished up in here, where we have polar bears, uh, parrots, ocelots, mules, and llamas. Okay, for a minute, I thought some of the dirt was broken. <laughs> Anyways, we're finished with that, and next up is the sixth floor, where there is a garden, so... Mostly I'm going to try to get some little areas of grass in, not like a whole lot, but like, you know, just like some little areas so people can kind of just look around and see. Plus, if I was trying to fill in the entire room with it, jeez, that'd take a while. So yeah, that's kind of what I have did in the last video and also put in the lights. So, you know, uh, I got like six, so maybe I should put something like this. Okay, so... Let's see how big this was. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so five by five. We'll do it by five by five. Okay. Then one, two, three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four, five. But. Okay, that's three and four. Okay, so like that. Yeah. Yeah, so we'll place the grass like that, and then every next, uh, and then every flower will be in each of these block coordinates. Of course, there would be wood fences around them too, so, you know, no one tramples on the flowers, because no one want to be trampled on flowers, right? If you don't want to trample flowers, that's just mean. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, oh, actually, it'll pretty much just be right at the end then. Five, and then just, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, you can also kind of hear them from above too, like the animals. So yeah, <laughs> while you're in here, you can hear nature above you. <laughs> I just hope none of them actually die. I don't know. I don't know how to really keep them alive, but... I feel like if they're kind of in their natural habitats, I think they might be fine. What I'm really worried about is the polar bears, because I don't know if they're in their proper nature. And we'll 
we'll see. But anyways, yeah, we've uh, at least put in all the grass block areas, so yeah. Wait, duh. I know how to do this. There we go. I thought I, I could have just maybe... Yeah, but then, yeah, then you can't even jump into it, you know? Yeah, that, okay, that works. I was thinking maybe put them on the grass blocks themselves, but I was thinking maybe this would actually just stop them anyways. Stop people from actually going on. It's Minecraft logic. <laughs> Alright, do this all around, and then we can place the flowers everywhere. And then it would look beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we just have this corner. And then all we have to do is just place down the flowers everywhere. Alright, so I guess we'll go for the dandelions first. Guess this doesn't have to be in a row, just placed. Can I place more around? No, it looks like it's a certain spot. Okay, poppies are next, which I guess I'll put them right here. Yeah, so they're kind of just bunched up together. Not really in a straight line, but you know. Alrighty, nice. Blue orchids are next. There we go. Uh, next we have Luma, I guess. And alrighty. And yeah, if we are finished this in this video, um, I will kind of just skip the seventh room because I can normal. I could just do that on my own time because I mean, you guys don't really want to see me remake the bathroom on the seventh floor, do you? I mean, who wants to see me remake the bathroom again? I think I'll just see I'll do it like sometime after I'm done the eighth floor so there we go yeah, oh almost done you still have uh, daisies to go daisy hi I'm daisy oh god and it is and there all right now we'll go right to the eighth floor and yeah is it it's pro no, it's not nighttime yet. No, it's daytime still. It's still daytime. Alright, so, like I said, I'm going to skip the 7th floor for now. Because that's just the bathroom, so I'll do that on my own time. So, technically, it's like uh, it's like we already finished the 7th floor. Okie dokie, then. Alright. And this is the restaurant. So, I do want to have at least the court blocks in here. Uh... Most likely, probably the uh, stair parts of them, too. And then, probably stuff in here that would be more like a kitchen, like uh, ovens, and then maybe trap doors for doors for like fridges and stuff. Actually, that would be in here. Uh, trap doors, trap doors, trap doors, there's no trap doors. Car says. Trap doors in here? No. Where are the where are the trap doors? Got them earlier. They gotta be in here. Where are they? Where? Where are they? Where are they? Where are those stinking trap doors. There they are. They're the bottom where I couldn't see them. Okay, and then um, maybe water. Maybe water. Uh, yeah. And that should be it in this room. At least this one, you kind of have a view, so. Okay. We'll put that there. Of course, we'll put stuff around, like, here and here as well. I mean, that spot's kind of all lit up anyways. Well, pro well, I mean, yeah, over there would probably still be lit anyways because of the sign of the H that is near it anyways, so... You know, that kind of works. Alrighty, so, uh, for the start of this, we will be, uh, making the main plot, like, the, uh, kitchen. So, we'll probably have it like this. 
Over there will be probably be more stuff. Not really a big kitchen, but you know. Uh, like that, I believe. Yeah. And then we'll just put stuff like that. And this will kind of be like a door area here, which I think maybe I should cover that up as well. So uh, let me just go over back to here. We'll use this and get rid of this. And that's the entrance. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, then all we have to do is mostly fill that in. And then that's the kitchen. Well, I still need to put everything in the kitchen. Then I can make the tables in this area as well. But I gotta admit, um, the one in my, uh, in my pocket edition one probably looked nicer because the ceiling was more like open air, I guess, like glass. But, uh, you know, this will probably have to do. Okay. So still just gotta play, oh, no, 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 no. Uh, there. Alrighty. Oh yeah, I also figured out something else I probably need in here. Chests for like food and stuff. Oh no 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 no. And then we can place more glowstones. Like that. And get a review and go like that. And then go like that. And this. And that. Okay, so, uh, so over here would probably be, like, the little sink area for, like, uh, whatever you need. So that's mostly why I need that. Okay, so for the ovens, they could be, like, right here for, like, anything that needs to be cooked. And then, uh, just over here we'll have, like, stuff like cupboards or fridges or stuff like that. Oops. No. Then, yeah, just place them like that. Close them. They set up weird, I know. Alright, so that'd be like cupboards, and then be like a little table just over here, and then, yeah, like I said, I probably need a chest to put some food in as well, so. Uh, chest, and mostly stuff that could be cooked too, so. Okay, so the chest is in. Might as well grab the food as well. Like, uh... Oh, we can add cake. <laughs> uh, let's see. We also have pork chop in here because that's like some raw food because then we can, uh, do stuff afterwards. So then we can have potatoes, rabbit, um, you, and you as well. Yeah, and then we'll just place stuff in here. Uh, just give me a minute, actually. I do need to go back to here because I should probably take all. And take all because this probably makes a lot more sense. Oh, crap. And potatoes. Cakes and chicken. Yeah. Alright, then we just do a little quick move for all the food. Simple cake. Cake. <laughs> cake was right there, anyways. Uh, maybe also a couple extra foods like uh, carrots, pumpkin pie, and cookies. And it could be also like stew. Okay, I guess we only have one stew at a time. Alright, I think I think the stew will probably be its own thing. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> we only have one soup of the day, so you better go and grab it. And anyways, uh, I think that's it for now. So, um, yeah, in between the videos, I will be working in here, seeing if I can get this main area done as well. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. See you dudes next time.